Today, a large portion of the internet experienced disruptions as services relying on Cloudflare began showing errors in downtime. If your favorite websites weren't opening, you're alone. Here's a quick breakdown of what happened, why it matters, and what you can do about it. Early today, users around the world began reporting issues with websites that run on Cloudflare's network. Pages failed to load, APIs broke, and many platforms slowed down. Cloudflare's status page listed multiple scheduled maintenances across data centers, and this timing lines up with the outage reports. Several global monitoring tools also detected drops in uptime during the same window. To understand why this outage caused such a ripple effect, it helps to know what Cloudflare actually does. Cloudflare sits between websites and users, acting as a CDN, DNS provider, security layer, and edge compute network. More than 20% of the internet depends on some part of Cloudflare's infrastructure. So when Cloudflare slows down, the internet slows down. As of now, Cloudflare has not confirmed a critical incident, but the outage overlaps with today's scheduled maintenance across several regions. Similar issues have happened before. For example, the June 2025 outage caused by failures in Cloudflare workers' storage layer. While we don't yet have an official root cause, the symptoms today point toward a network-level disruption during maintenance. The outage impacted websites, SaaS tools, login systems, and apps that rely on Cloudflare's DNS or Edge services. Businesses using Cloudflare may have seen slower load times, temporary downtime, API failures, broken login pages, higher error rates on customer-facing apps. If you run a website or app, here's what you should do right now. One, check status.cloudflare.com for live updates. Two, review any Cloudflare rules or DNS routes you modified recently. Three, enable fallback or backup DNS if you have one. Four, notify your customers to prevent panic. Five, log the exact downtime window for your incident report. These internet-wide disruptions are a reminder of how much infrastructure depends on just a few cloud networks. I'll keep tracking Cloudflare's updates, and once an official postmortem is released, I'll break it down for you. Thanks for watching. Stay tuned, stay secure, and don't forget to like and subscribe for more real-time cybersecurity breakdowns.